Jones just a bit too in the first round. That performance will raise a lot of eyebrows. Wow, Irene Eldana proving that she's among the best inside the Bantamweight division. Good defense by Aldana. Oh, she gave her back. Aldana's gonna fall over the top though here. She's gonna fall over the top. Aldana trying to go belly down and there's the tap. Irene Aldana by submission. I mean, right here, look, Ben shoots this shot. She must have hit her head on the knee, but Aldana with great takedown defense just shoving the head away. I thought she was gonna fall over the top here. Right here, it looks like she's losing position, but instead she's attacking the arm. Great transition by Irene Aldana right away knowing, I'm falling over, let me attack this top. But look, also had the triangle there. Belly down arm bar, all of her weight on top of Cojeda. Cojeda had no choice but to tap. I mean, what a fantastic fight by both of these women. Great job by Irene Aldana to go and take the judges out of what would be a very, very difficult decision. Doing again with a nice right hand. She's definitely earned the respect of Eldana, but Eldana's still very aggressive. And yeah, she still feels in control. You know, she's got her overhands going. Her jab is beautifully on point. I mean, while Van Duin is having some success, she's eating a lot of punishment. Another right hand answers with a kick. And Eldana coming forward. Here's the combination. The flurry from the Mexican. This is exactly Van Duin in trouble. Final seconds of round one. Oh. Eldana trying to stop it right that's, here. That's it. It is done. Already Eldana wow. in the final moment. Credit to Irene Albana. She had taken some punishment, but she never lost that forward movement. And you know, if you look at the damage on the face of Van Duin, um, that's, uh, that's pretty extensive. She got hit. And Irene Albana once again shows her strikes. Chance early. Aldana has a pretty significant uh, crowd advantage, if you will. She does, but you know, this is actually Colleen's hometown. It was stumbled from Colleen there. Able to recover for the time being, but uh, gives up her back here. Aldana takes it, tries to get a hook in, not able to do so. Now she does. She's working she's a, full on. a rear naked here. I can't see if it's underneath. It looks like it's underneath her chin from here. Schneider playing it calm and cool, trying to peel the hand away. Smartly done. Aldana pushes back, getting to the ground so she can get a little bit more leverage for the push. Arena Aldana the gets it done. Colleen Schneider forced to tap early. Victory comes the way of rear naked choke for Arena Aldana. Let's look at the replay, Julie. Okay, so she's hitting her with this barrage of attacks. You see Colleen step back, um, trying to regain her balance, and then it jumps. Throwing those right hands, those right hooks, jumps on her back and sinks in that choke, standing. Now, you see Colleen fighting it, and Anna very, very smartly pulls herself backwards, so she has the leverage to finish this choke. It's very, very tight, and she gets the tap. Arena Aldana gets it done, and the chance going crazy here inside the Shrine Auditorium. Man, they're throwing heat. Ketlin is fighting mad. She's fighting mad. She's trying to get back at her because Aldana keeps touching her. You know, she, you see how she's doing it? She's winging yeah. these, but she's not there. Oh! Irene Aldana! No! That'll change your career! Let's take a look at this again. Bank on the chin. What? Look at this. On top. Boom! That right Big hand. right hand. Oh. And again, out oh. cold. I mean, that is a picture-perfect left perfect. hook. That was perfect. Jumping left Ooh. hook. Man, I mean, Irene Aldana has some beautiful technique. Joe, and we were saying that earlier, just everything's so technical. Right, yep. the perfect range. Perfect. Perfect.